tell me about this? Individuals often weigh the costs and benefits of various actions. If you are considering a large purchase like a car, you might explicitly write out the pros and cons of the models you are considering. If you are deciding whether or not to see a movie, you'll probably just think to yourself whether or not the film looks good enough to spend $20 on. Some decisions require us to weigh the total costs and benefits, and some require us to weigh the additional costs and benefits. If an individual enrolls in college, they'll have to pay tuition, fees, and the costs of books. They'll weigh this cost against the future benefits of a college degree, like a higher salary and a sense of personal accomplishment. Once the decision to attend college for a semester has been made, the student faces many additional decisions. For example, does the student attend their 8 a.m. class today, or do they sleep in instead? In the moment their alarm goes off, they make a decision. Hit snooze to sleep more, but miss out on class material, or go to class and miss out on more sleep. This type of decision is called a marginal decision. Marginal in this context means additional or incremental. We make marginal decisions all the time. We already paid the fee to get into the amusement park, but now we have to decide which ride we want to ride. So the best rides have long lines. The short ones, not so much. Do we want to wait in line 45 minutes to ride some amazing bone-crushing roller coaster? Or do we want to wait just 10 minutes to go on the lazy river? Roller coaster. All right. In the decision to apply for a new credit card, an individual would weigh the total benefits, access to credit, rewards, etc., with the total costs, revolving credit, credit score impact. Each time the individual decides to use the credit card for a purchase, it is a marginal decision. Many businesses use the marginal decision-making of their customers to increase revenues. For instance, airlines will offer a low price for a seat. But then, when you're packing your bag, you have to make a marginal decision about how many things to bring and how many bags to pay for. Once you're at the airport, they offer you more marginal decisions. You can opt for a wider seat with legroom or an upgrade. Some airlines offer perks such as exclusive lounges for frequent flyers willing to upgrade. These are decisions about the marginal benefits. The airlines are clearly hoping that once you've made the original purchase, what economists call the sunk costs, that you'll be willing to pay more because the marginal benefit exceeds the marginal cost. When resources are scarce, we face trade-offs. So every time we want to make a decision, we have to weigh out the cost and the benefits, both marginal and total. For our actions and our decisions, there is always an opportunity cost. 